I'm told you're a big MMA fan. Do you have any thoughts on the upcoming weekend's slate? Of- I got some predictions, dude. Um, it's going to be a great card. I'm, I'm really impressed by the card, uh, even the undercard. I think um, uh, I'm going to start with Islam and Dover. Uh, I got to go with Islam, but Dover is, is going to be a good fight, I think. I think it might be fight of the night, to be honest. Mm-hmm. Um, I think every fight's going to go by pretty quickly. Um, I think Al Jermaine, I want Al Jermaine to win. Uh, I like Al Jermaine. I thought his fight with uh, Corey Sanhagen was amazing. Uh, and Corey's great, too. Uh, he might be coming back uh, right after those two amazing wins. Um, so I'm going to go Al Jermaine over P- uh, Piotr Jan. Okay. <laughs> and then you got, uh, well, you got Amanda Nunez versus uh, Megan Anderson. Yes. I'm going to go, I got to go Amanda because I, just because what she did to, Cyborg was insane. Like I've never seen Cyborg take that much damage like that before. So I think he's going to do the same thing to Megan. But it's going to be a tough fight, I think. Too. I think it's, I think it's going to be a tough fight. Have you, uh, Megan's dope. Have you ever thought of doing it yourself? Yeah, man. My dad taught me how to fight when I was four. He taught me how to box. And um, I got older. You know, uh, I never liked to fight, but I didn't mind it because <laughs> of where I was from. Okay. Um, I always had to stand up for yourself. When I moved to L.A., I got into jiu-jitsu uh, at Clone Gracie's gym in Culver City, and then um, I got into uh, kickboxing. But I'll always love boxing, always. And MMA, I love MMA. But Kung Fu, I taught myself Kung Fu when I was, like, in eighth grade. What do you mean you taught, what do you mean you taught yourself Kung Fu, Jermaine? Uh, it don't sound strange, but I used to go to the library and uh, pick up Kung Fu books and uh, just read them and learn the stances in my, in my bedroom and uh, because... I was training to kick my dad's ass. Uh, that's what I was training to do. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So, yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, but, I, you know, and I got to go. Um, I, I, my, I think I got to, uh, I, I think Polish power might win, uh, might win t- uh, tomorrow night. I think, uh, I okay. think Jan might, might pull it off. What do you think, TJ? My, he's my UFC 259 expert. What do you think of these choices, uh, TJ? Jefferson? I like his choices. I think he's pretty spot on. I'm, I'm literally, you know, I'm, kind of torn with the yawn israel fight uh i know that's a tough one i have a hard time betting against izzy um even though he's going up oh, and you weight. should you should that was a tough decision for me too i didn't I, like but every time i think izzy like you know every time izzy faces like a, you know a power guy what does he do he, he upsets him you yeah. know so i can you can pick izzy like it's i think it's fine it's my only issue is he's going up and wait uh that's it you know, and, and Jan isn't a joke. Like, people sleep on Jan, too. Like, everyone's doubted Jan since he, you know, since the beginning. Mm-hmm. And look at him now. So, well, I'll tell I, you, you what, can't go wrong with either fighter. Izzy could be in Coming to America 3. I'll tell you that. That Maybe, guy, ooh. he is hilarious. Yeah. He's funny, dude. By the way, he is he is laugh out loud hilarious. Izzy. I like Izzy, man. Izzy's dope. He'd be a dope. I think he'd be great to have him. If they do a third one, I think he, I would love to, okay. love to do a scene with him. Well, that'd be great. That'd be awesome. Well, yeah. I don't know. Did you ever talk UFC with Judd Hirsch on the set of Superior Donuts? I think not. That's why you come on a show <laughs> like this, Jermaine. But Judd, Judd can fight. No, Judd, Judd's got an attitude problem. <laughs> what? Judd Hirsch has an attitude problem? What are yeah, you saying? Man, not, not in a bad way. Like, if you get on Judd's bad side, he might slap you. Like. <laughs> <laughs> I Judd, love that. Judd's from New York. Judd's from New York, baby. You don't mess with no New York. Oh, I think no, he's from Brooklyn don't. or the Bronx or one of those. <laughs> so, don't mess. Yeah. Oh, fantastic. Well, you've uh, had a hell of a career so far. Good luck uh, moving forward. Come back on the show anytime. And I can't wait to uh, catch Coming to America uh, as soon as I'm able. Thanks for the call. Appreciate it, Jermaine. Uh, it was a pleasure. Thank you for having right me. Right back at you, Jermaine Fowler. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.